all of us are on this journey. We're someplace beginning. Some of us are renegades. Some of us are reverent. Some of us are receivers. But I think if we, if we're, we would say, yeah, I want to be a relator. I want to be one of Jesus' closest followers. I want to grow in my relationship with him. We're all somewhere on that progression. And so I appreciate that you and I, we get to listen, eavesdrop, and kind of look into that conversation between Jesus and one of his closest relationships, his mom, right? And it's not like the, the conversation he had when he was 12, hey, how come you were looking for me? We lost the son of God. That's, you know, he's a 12-year-old man at that point. This is now a fully formed adult. He's a carpenter. He's on and beginning his ministry. So this conversation between Jesus and his mom, it shows us what it can look like to have a very deep relationship, vibrant, healthy, constructive, engaging conversation with Jesus. And so here's how the conversation unfolds. And I want to really accentuate this whole thing because it all revolves around a need. Mary comes to Jesus and says to him, hey, they have run out of wine. They've run out of wine. There's a need. And I want to point that out because on our journey from, from being a spectator and intentional to develop into a relator, we're going to go through times, experiences where we have needs. And some of us, we think needs are money. But need can be a whole spectrum of stuff, family. And need can be wisdom. Need can be health. Need can be uh, emotional stability. Need can be a job. Need can be time, <laughs> right? I mean, time. How many, how many could identify at least a couple needs you have now? You're like, yeah, I need you to be quiet so we can get on with, the, with my dad to go grocery shopping, clean the house, and just, <laughs> I get it, I get it. But need, need is important. And so when Mary points this out to Jesus, I would say it's an invitation. It's not just an invitation to Jesus. It also is our invitation. Our needs in our lives are invitations for Jesus to participate. But it's also an invitation to know Jesus better. The needs in your life are invitations, opportunities for you to know Jesus better. And with that mindset, I think we can appreciate needs instead of complain about them and get discouraged with them and resent them. I wish I didn't have, you know, family, if we see these as opportunities, I'm on the road to relating and all these needs are opportunities for me to know Jesus better and to become a stronger, deeper relator.